welcome back to the Tesla, guys. I mean, she's looking good. The handle works. So we're back up to 209 miles. Uh, if you watched the earlier vlog, um, so I realized that Katie's this morning, my, my, uh, these buttons for, for the window, they don't, uh, they, they don't, they don't do anything. So yeah, we're going to troubleshoot that. Let's, let's see if we can figure out what the culprit is. Well, kind of, well, one second, let's get out of the garage. Cause yeah. All right, so I'm hoping my screen doesn't stay black like the last time I tried to reset everything. I don't know if a reset is gonna fix the uh, door windows, but we're gonna go ahead and try it. So you hold down the two scroll wheels, the center touchscreen will turn off. You just wait and wait and keep waiting. I'll wait a little bit more and uh, yeah, just you know continue to wait. And if you keep waiting, keep waiting, yep, and uh, wait a little bit. Um, you just wait for it. Um, we're just gonna wait. Yeah, just hanging out here waiting, waiting for the Tesla T logo to show up. Never does, we're in big trouble. If it does show up, we're golden, and it should show up. Sometimes it takes a little while, so you just kind of keep waiting. Up oh, there it is, look at that. Look at that, guys. It actually worked this time. Um, we didn't break the car, thank goodness. Last time that never turned back on. That did turn back on. We're almost golden. Gotta wait for it to boot up. Yeah, from uh, from here, from this point, we're we're gonna we're gonna see if, if those switches work again. But we're gonna let it completely load. Up oh, there we go. Okay, we got the map up and oh, uh oh, that's never good. We don't want the red exclamation point. Ah, uh, you gotta be kidding me. All right, let's just hope that once this loads, that goes away. Cause right now I don't have 3G connection. Um, so I'm hoping that little red exclamation point will go away. More to come. Hey, look at that guys, we got 3G connection and the uh, red exclamation point went away, so it looks like we're good to go on this front. So let's go ahead and uh, give the, ah, uh, uh, it doesn't work still. Nope, no fix, okay. The last thing to do is, is when I get back, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try that window switch and see if maybe it's just like this panel or the wiring. Uh, well, if the passenger side works and mine doesn't, well, that's called isolating the problem and uh, well then you can kind of just say maybe when he was uh, fixing the, the, the door handle I forgot to like plug that back I don't, I don't know I don't know I feel like I tried it one other day and I thought maybe I just didn't push hard enough but maybe it didn't work before he fixed the door handle so maybe it wasn't him I don't, I don't really know because I was using the window sometimes to get into my car I was putting my window down um, instead of like reaching all the way up to the front latch I would put my window down reach in and open it when my door handle was broken so it was working. It was it was definitely working, um, but yeah, Ugh. it's always something, guys. It's it's always something. All right. So trying to reset the screen clearly clearly did not work. I'm hoping it's just this. But all right, one second. I gotta I gotta actually like pull over because I can't really reach that too well. So all right, here we go. Ready? Oh wait, guys. No way. Look at that. Auto up and down. Both work. So clearly it's just this. I mean, I try, like, the lock, like, I mean, just nothing works, so, yeah. Guess we're, guess we're calling Tesla Mobile Repair again, because, yeah, that's, that's, that's kind of a bummer. And still not working, still not working. Yep, the, uh, I mean, I thought, like, maybe the lock was on, but, like, there's a, there's a, there's a light right there that lights up if the, if the windows are locked, so, like, I don't, I don't think that's the issue. It's, all right, so I didn't get this vlog out yesterday, so I figured I'd throw this in there. So um, the whole gist is is well, obviously that my my window doesn't work, and well, it's it wasn't a huge deal, except today I happen I happen to be in a parking garage, and well, in parking garages you you typically have these tickets where you got to get them on the way in and the way out, and the way you get them is by rolling the window down. <laughs> And I couldn't roll my window down, so I have to pull up just past, just past the ticket thing, put my car in park so I can kind of get out of my door a little bit and pay the ticket. Now, uh, somebody commented actually that I guess you can just pop the, the buttons out of the door uh, if you're careful just to not damage the plastic and check the wiring. I might, I might try it. I might, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to watch some videos online, watch some YouTube videos most likely, see if that's a 
feasible option. The thing is, my car is covered under warranty, and so, well, yeah, it's covered under warranty. So, I, you know, it's it's not a it's not a big deal. It's it's just that you got to schedule an appointment. Until you schedule an appointment, you uh, you're kind of out of luck. So right now we're about to pay with the ticket. Yeah, I'm gonna have to like gotta un unbuckle because well, my window obviously still doesn't work. So uh, yeah, no one's behind me right now, so I don't I don't feel that pressure. Uh, big money, no whammies. Let's go. See, I'm just waiting on this guy, but luckily there's nobody behind me. Oh, oh, I thought someone was coming. She just pulled up just past it. Put my car into park real quick. Crack the door. There we go. All right. All right. All right. Let's get the car back in the drive. Get my seatbelt back on. Oof. There we go. All right. Yeah, I just don't want to, you know, hold up the line, but I'm that guy. I am that guy. I mean, it's just all these little things that have really started to start going wrong. It's weird. It's weird. I don't know why this, like, all of this stuff started suddenly going wrong. I guess, you know, the door, the door could have been unplugged because the guy fixing my door just didn't quite, uh, didn't quite plug something back in. I don't, I don't know what it is, but either way, yes, my, uh, my window does not work. The driver's, the driver's window does not work at all. And well, that's simply because that panel doesn't work. Uh, obviously, if you're in the passenger seat, as you guys just saw earlier in the vlog, if you use another button, the windows work. So it's, it's clearly, it's clearly this switch. I, uh, it's either unplugged or something with the wiring went, went bad. Point being, I'm either gonna schedule a service appointment. I probably will schedule that anyways, because I can always cancel that. And you never know how long those are gonna take. But um, I may try to pop it off and just see what's going on. Because if it's plugged in, obviously, something, something, a fuse blew, a wire went bad. I don't know what it is. If it's not that, then I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, uh, that's, that's, that's going to wrap up today's vlog. So if you guys are enjoying these videos, which a lot of people seem to not be enjoying them based on some of the comments, but some people are, please like and subscribe. Otherwise, thanks for watching.